restaurant report card. It's something you've probably never seen before. A local restaurant gets a violation for not having a toilet seat. NBC Charlotte's Bill McGinty shows us the joints you might want to stay away from. Yeah, hey there, everybody. This week's lowest score on the restaurant report card goes to Fonda Lata Kiza out here on Albemarle Road in East Charlotte. Yeah, Fonda had some problems. Inside, the on-site manager showed me the cracks and holes in the walls. One was patched, the other is not. That's where the health department noted they needed to be sealed up to keep pests out. They also noted no toilet seat in the ladies' room. The manager checked for me. Yep, she says it's now there. And being a guy, I'm just going to take her word for it. Fonda also had issues with the holding temperatures of their food, both hot and cold. They were cited for that. Overall, they got an 84.5, and that is a B. Also in the bottom three this week, the International Supermarket on North Tryon. And they were dinged for having a dirty food prep sink. The health inspector saw fish scales from the day before, in the sink, and on the scaler. For this, they got an 87.5, and that is a B. The Morazon restaurant on Archdale made the bottom three this week, too. They were cited for storing raw foods like burger right above the ready-to-eat foods. That's a big no-no, and cross-contamination between cooked and uncooked food is something that can make you sick. On the top three this week, two food lions and the Jimmy John's on South Tryon. They all got A scores. And that is this week's restaurant report card. Remember, everybody, you can always check the lowest scores of your favorite restaurant on WCNC.com, or you can go directly to the Mecklenburg County Health Department. I'm Bill McGinty, NBC Charlotte. All right, we'll move on.